Right, so today, guys, we're going to be playing the uh, Rick Taylor in Streets of Rage 2, like I promised. Uh, like I say, this will be much better, this video, because unlike the last time i done it, it's actually going to play this at a normal speed, so the music won't be frantic. Um, yeah, just want to have a proper go on this, really, if I'm honest. So, let's go. Now, I am playing this, obviously, on a Super Retro Trio 3 Plus, or what it, Trio Plus, should I say. Still keep getting the name of that wrong. It's, it's too long a name. Um... I've just got to flick the switch over so the Mega Drive controller that I've got in it is accepted. And here we go. Right, okay. And we're in. Right, so obviously um, Rick is under what used to be, is it Max? I think it's Max. The wrestler guy. Yeah, it was Max. Right. Let's go. Oh, we hit the special button in. That was silly. Right, now one thing I have noticed is that Rick Taylor is pretty overpowered and also you don't even have to turn around and hit the bad guys he automatically elbows back when they're behind him so it does make it a little bit too easy I've got to be honest hits he's dead <laughs> obviously this is uh, a hack of streets of rage 2 He throws the knife. Yeah, he doesn't. Oh, he does. Yeah, you got to hit B and C together. It took a while though. I, I pushed that quite a few times before that actually worked. Not a bad hack though, to be fair. Sometimes you get some and they're awful but this one's actually not too bad look at that one hit he was dead keep picking up this food I don't really need it because I haven't lost any life yet <laughs> So far, it's all just a little bit too easy. I mean, that might change, but at the moment, it's too easy. Which, don't get me wrong, it's, it's good to see what they've done here, but it kind of takes the enjoyment out of it if it's too easy. Yeah, at the moment, I'm just plowing through these guys. None of them have even touched me yet. Let's see if that changes now we're at a boss. See that? He automatically hit the guy behind him without me turning. Or without hitting the button so he hits backwards. So you haven't even really got to be facing him. One more hit and he's done. Oh! The only reason he hit me there was because he reached down to pick the knife up. 
idiot. <laughs> right, that's it. On to the next bit. Right. Let's see if there's anything for me to pick up. Oh, I actually got hit then. The only thing I would say with the uh, design of Rick. I mean, it definitely looks like Rick, there's no doubt about it. But the mask and all that, and the shading on his on his uh, body and that looks fine. It's just the overalls he's wearing that just look a little bit scruffy looking. And yeah, I think if Dad had done a better job on his what he's wearing, it would have looked better from an aesthetic point of view. But, you know, you can't have everything. Right, so he's special. He does like a roll, does he? Yeah. Wow. Don't need many of them to kill her. <laughs> Done. Causes us any problems really. Oh, I actually got flung in. hit him that much. knife actually does less damage than if I kick or punch him. <laughs> now that's funny. So in other words, it's pointless picking the weapons up, it takes longer to kill them. I mean it looks good, but it's not very effective. Interesting that. Get him then. Right, so I'm actually getting hit now, so that is one difference. Yeah, that's got slightly harder. That shouldn't have got me really, he wasn't in line with me there. That's one of the most annoying things about every version of this game. The bikes. <laughs> They're really annoying. 
because they just seem to hit you constantly. Yeah, Rick is quite slow. I mean, even when I'm seeing the bike coming towards me, I have trouble getting out of the way of it. Now, it is one thing I would say that is a disadvantage with Rick. He's too slow. But then he is overpowered, so I suppose you've got to have... So I've actually lost a life now. You've got to have that uh, balance. So it's not a bad way to balance it, I suppose. Barrel, then. Oh, he's dead already. <laughs> That's funny. that rocket guy in it <laughs> yeah this is where I'll get hard because Rick's slow why can't I hit this guy Oh, he got double tap forwards and he does a slide as well. That's interesting. Ah, oh, yeah, trying to hit this guy's a problem. Where are you? Yeah, it's not getting him. Yeah, nothing's getting him at this point. Yeah, this is not good. Ah, right, got him then. Gotta get him when he comes down. Unfortunately, you don't always get the time to react to that. Yeah, he's very slow. God, oh, man, I can't get the move in before he hits me. Gotcha. Yeah, so there are stages where his speed goes against you, as you saw there.
that's interesting. They didn't hit backwards then when the guy come behind us, which normally he does. So it seems to work when it feels like it, that. Yeah, it worked then. rolling I wanted the kick normally only does the roll if you push forwards apologies if you can hear any background noise uh, my neighbor's kids are outside in the garden at the moment so they're uh, playing so they so might be picking them up on here so apologies if that's the case Kids are kids though. Gotta let them play. To be honest, don't get many kids that do play outside these days. I think we'll leave that one there. Um, yeah, it, it is very easy. To be honest with you, you could go for this hardly paying attention and just clobber everyone with Rick, to be honest. Um, but it's interesting nonetheless. So, yeah. Um, like I say, when you use Rick, it is a little bit too easy. But then saying that, there are areas that are harder because he's slower. Um, he is massively overpowered. Yeah, you know, some of the guys you only hit them three times and they're dead. So, but yeah, just interesting. You know, it's a hack. So, it's really, when I I bought this, I bought this just to see what it was like. So, yeah, interesting to play anyway, nonetheless. Right, okay, I'm gonna leave that one there then, guys. Hope you uh, enjoyed the video, and if you did, please like, share, and subscribe, and also hit the notification bell. And when you do, click all. That way I'll let you know when we do our videos and live streams. And until next time, take care, stay safe, Nerdy Geezer out.